All right, guys. Today we're here to talk about the problem with little babies' new album. It's only me. The problem is, little baby is a good rapper. That's not a problem. But let me just say this: little baby's a good rapper. He has many songs I enjoy. However, on this album, it seems like Lil Baby doesn't know how to make a hit in 2022. Um, it sounds like he's trying to make a hit, trying to make a vibe, trying to make a sound, but it's not working for him. It just doesn't work for him. A lot of songs don't connect on the album. Um, it's a very tasking listen. The promo single, Hey, is... One of the worst little baby singles I heard in my life that he's ever released. And overall, I believe the 200k plus sales he's getting is because of the popularity of his name. He's a popular rapper. I think he is number one in the game. Um, there's Drake, Kanye West, and then Lil Baby, in my opinion. There's no rapper or the new school that's being a little baby. Let's be honest. Lil Dirk is his boy. Lil Dirk still isn't bigger than Lil Baby. The baby at one point was bigger than Lil Baby. He ruined that for himself. Roddy Rich at one point could have been bigger than Lil Baby. He can't do it now. Trippy Red, no. Lil Uzi Vert and Lil Baby. I would say it at the same pace, but Lil Baby might have some more mainstream appeal in my opinion. So, rap game wise, Lil Baby is the biggest in the game other than the OTs and Legends and the guys that have been around for a while like J. Cole, Drake, Kanye, Jay, etc. And the problem with the album is, like I said, he's trying to make a coherent sound, trying to make it hit, but it's missing every single step of the way. Nothing sounds like a hit. Some stuff sounds like it could be a banger, but it's not. It doesn't have that little baby touch. There's no drip too hard. There's no um, south sides. There's no yes and deeds. There's no close friends. There's no we paid. There's no graces with 42 dogs. There's no emotionally scarred. There's no hows. There's no song on this album that sounds like something that you would want to continuously scream and listen and come back to. I think this week, it's only me and my turn. It's going to have better first week sales, but mark my words. This album would not be in the top 10 for multiple weeks like my turn was. This album would not continue to be played and screamed. The second week sales of this album is going to be pathetic. Nobody's going to listen to this past a month or two for now. And I say it's not going to go to platinum because he has... He put in a minute on the album, and that's a popular song of his right now. It's doing good numbers. So that song will carry most of the album sales. I believe Hey has a decent amount of traction. People are trying to do it like Baby Challenge and trying to do that. The song with him and 42 Doug, I'm sorry. The song with him and Arnold Wick on the album, that might be another song that TikTok gets aboard with, but it's not going to be a whole string of hits like uh, My Turn. My Turn commercial with Louis Vert, Living Out My Closet with Future. We paid on Deluxe. And most of you scarred. Uh, Grace with 42 Doug is my favorite track on the album. And there's millions of YouTube views, millions of screams. That song went crazy. Uh, How is another uh, track? Catch the Sun, the song of uh, uh, Slim and King or whatever that movie is. That song's a nice little baby vibe type flow. The point is, Lil Baby has stuff on this album that resembles his old self. And he might be trying to go a new direction, but I don't think that's what he's trying to do with this album. Because the beats, they sound up to date, but it doesn't sound like something that he should continue to try to flow on. Some of these beats just sound miscasted for Lil Baby in a way. Anyway, let me know what you think about the new Lil Baby album. Do you think that I'm tripping? And do you think this is a good album? Or do you think that the album is bad like I think it is? I don't think it's horrible, but I do think it's bad. I never want to listen to it again. And shout out to T Grizzly for making a good album. Because Chapter of the Trenches, I listened to that multiple times. I have not listened to Lil Baby album again. Listened to it one time, and I forgot the last like eight songs off it because they all sound the same. And, and one last thing, I'm a huge fan of Jeremiah. Him and Jeremiah on that song, I thought it was gonna be some great stuff going on. It was horrible. I never went to hear that song again either. Anyway, this has been Chef Muffin Dome. I'm signing out. Peace.